Next level is Ski Jump. 150k budget. And we have to get this car to this top part. And can we only hit it where the flag is? Oh, and we have walls in the way. Interesting. Okay. So how fast do you go? 25. You're pretty speedy. Okay. So presumably, like, what they want us to do is... This, that's that's probably overly aggressive. This thing looks like it moves pretty quick. So let's, uh... No, we don't want unlocked tangents. We want that. I think it's gonna it's gonna go right off. Hold on, I just want to press play. Yeah, so it it goes right off here. So we need to let's let's freehand this. So like, I think we wanna. Let's go with something like that, maybe. I really haven't the foggiest idea how much uh, <laughs> how much distance we're gonna get. So that's kind of where I'm starting here. Is with uh, with the question of if we just made something that looks like this and we just. Just supported it a wee bit. Nailed it. When in doubt, all the steel. Yeah, there's there's definitely gonna be a lot of strain. I'm also let's bring it down to one speed. No need to. Yeah, so so the issue, and this is kind of the issue that I was wondering about, was we we don't want it we want the ski jump we want it to get onto the downhill where it is its tires are still impacting the road so we don't want and then just out of Mostly impatience, I guess I'll call it. We'll do a rather healthy under over type of dealy. That didn't look like it connected. No, it did not. Yep, that, that doesn't look like that should, that's not the way that should work at all. Okay, we got a lot of we got a lot of distance to cover. I wonder if So maybe maybe we do want to really kind of like go down like this and then if we just flatten this out To me, this is like the the implication of the level. So let's let's try that out. I'm unashamed. We'll use we'll use a lot of those, and then I'm I'm supposing that there's not going to be a lot of strain on this. We may need to add another foundation just because this is like an insanely long. Sp 
band to be supporting, but maybe we'll go with something like that. Okay, yeah, it is it is a really long way. Wow, I am grossly underestimating the uh This isn't rotating, that's fixed. I wonder if Is there such a thing as like a downhill banana bridge cuz I don't think this car weighs a lot. Yeah, it's very light. So what does a banana bridge look like? It's kind of like this and then I think we're supposed to use the same. This is, this is a weird idea, but if we can cross this span while also building a little bit of speed and then have a more established foundation, I think there's something interesting here. And when this fails, I'm going to wish that I had just went for cable the first time around, but... So we... We angle those first few up. Okay, any chance? Yeah, no. But given how far across this is, if we can get this to hold even with the Cadillac of resources, I think it will be no small feat. The road breaking. Is not a great sign. I don't think this is the I don't think this is the play. I really would have liked to have gotten something gotten something going where I also really want to go through the uh the this particular gap or or clear the whole thing. <laughs> Hmm, so, yeah, I think we want to go down in a relatively straight fashion and then come back up like this. There's also a part of me that's wondering if, like, you could do a big swing. <laughs> just, just because, you know, the difficulty level isn't already there, but... Oh, I should have the grid on for this. This is a bad idea. Let the record show the defendant recognizes that this is not a good idea. But there's something interesting about I really thought that was going to connect. Okay, so 
So if I just made a really long rope swing, is there any chance that we can catch this guy? This is probably too long and we'll probably end up in the water. Also, no, no shot. I don't think it's quite fast enough. Yeah. We'd have to start way up here, and even then, I think the, the, the train leaves. Oh, that's actually not as bad as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> I'm amazed that this steel breaks, but I guess I'm, I'm not entirely surprised. Yeah, that's going to be, I think if we wanted to do that, we would want to have it swing this way and catch it more over here. I mean, we can try that, but that means we would need to, I think, oops, hello? Sometimes selecting is a little janky. So if we did something like this and then put the rope over here. Shouldn't have put the, the thing on. Now we can't, we do have to be careful because we can't hit the foundations either. Yeah. All right. Back, back to more conventional plans. Okay, so let's just, let's just make a bridge that works as a starting point. And I will put I'm going to do a little bit of a triangle here. And then I think I think we should have no problem making this bridge. Play nicely with others. Turn off the grid so we can actually get a little bit of control here, and then, okay, so that, can't imagine that would break. All right. My imagination has been tested. Okay. Good stuff. So now we will we will continue downward. Probably like here. where I'm going to start the upward trajectory, perhaps? I think I'm just going to... Whoops. Okay, I like I like what we got going on. So let's uh let's see what Let's see what a jump looks like if we just did one like that. Just, I, I want to get a feeling for if we are like super far out from our desired landing or not. Had some good distance, but I do think we're, we're still in the phase of wanting to build more, more speed. 
This is unnecessary. This is unnecessary. So do we do we keep continuing down? If we just want to get through this gap, I think we do. Not the plan. There we go. And then this is this is all going to be shaved significantly because I don't think we uh like none of this is is load bearing. Obviously the jump is going to endure some some forces, but And clearly the the like success criteria here is going to be is going to be about number of foundations. That seems very very reasonable. Oh, okay. So that so there's definitely some Maybe, maybe a cross brace across here does more than I think it does. Okay, so this, this transition looks like where we could smooth it out a little bit. I like that we're kind of like Indiana Jonesing it and sort of racing, <laughs> racing away from the collapsing bridge behind us right now. Okay. I'm content to accept that we're going to have a point of inflection there, so why not do that? There was an insane flex there. Hold on. What, what was going on here? That ah, wasn't that bad, actually. Okay. Well, let's... Uh... Let's just test it out. I mean, we're still under budget, so... Too much... We need, we need to go, we need to take it down a notch, I think. I think that one actually just goes away. Oh, we don't want the, the foundation clipping through the road. Hitting the foundation is never good for business. I mean, my goal was to get through that top one, and I feel like we're we're closer than I expected us to be. This is where we need to go through. Uh oh! 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 There we go. Okay. So I mean, so we could just lower it down and get the win. And going through this lowest one is definitely the. Uh, the preferred, preferred one. Do we, does it mean we need, maybe we need more speed. So yeah, so maybe let's just get, let's see if we can just get the W by just adjusting our, our structure here. Okay, so that breaking was not great, but this is like extremely haphazardly designed. So let's, uh, Make something that we know to be stronger. Ooh, that was like 
shockingly close to, I think, the 50 even. Right, we need to go above the mouse cursor to get the 50. So here's here's what I'm thinking. Well, we'll we'll worry about budget in a second here. Let's let's get let's get it through any one of the gaps. Are we too high or too low on that one? I think we're too high still. <laughs> we got it. <laughs> absolutely, uh, absolutely terrible. Yet we are in the top 39%. This is a fun map though. So let's see. So if we wanted to just get the five, I think we actually don't even need this foundation, which will save us a bunch of money. Like, I kind of feel like something like this might get us the five. If it didn't break, it might. Shocked that that road broke. Still the road? Still the road. We can make that one go a little flatter, and even, maybe even go make that one go a little flatter. We don't need much vertical, I don't think. How do we? Hmm. Let's get this locked in place and then maybe we can just add a... Adding a steel cable here doesn't... It's still a lot cheaper than having that last foundation. Okay, we need to go higher. Which I, I think means we, the foundation location is just bad. That might be the... The issue is, is we're better off having the foundation here and starting... Oops. Something like that. Because that way... Whoops. So the reasoning here, obviously, is that the... Well, we've lost... This wall brace is no longer... I'm okay spending some steel over here. Ooh, we are close. Okay. I heard a break, but we get it. That puts us in the top 15, and I think that road might that that piece that broke might just be deletable. And we have we have a ton of shaving we could do. Okay. That feels pretty good. So let's see. So certainly we've overbuilt some parts of this. I'm pretty happy with this. I think the big question that I am wondering about is I've seen I've seen a strategy and I want to I want to kind of try it out. So I've seen uh, another YouTuber who is very good. I think his name is Reed Captain. Apologies if I got that wrong. But something that, that they do from time to time is they do like uh, essentially like these these type of like structures, like arcs down like this in like a spider webbing pattern. And they seem very, very strong. And then I think what they do is they...
feel like I feel like there is a, a huge knowledge gap that I have here where I'm like, but I don't actually know how they do this. Yeah, no, this is not gonna. <laughs> That's not gonna happen in its current form. I am wondering if this gap here is something that we can support with a single one. This this is the one that I think would be the most likely one to go away. I feel like under supports all the way is the the way to go. We could hold on. We could also we could also try something like a very well. I mean, if we just hold on, let's let's try just shaving first. Like if we just made this like a an arch like that, because I don't think that one's that. Load bearing -y. It turns out it is that load bearing -y. That doesn't look like it's necessarily doing much. That might, maybe that supports it better. There's a lot of strain on this one, even before the car comes down. One piece of steel here doesn't. Yeah, and then the butterfly effect starts to take hold, but but this is maybe we can do a shave like that if we have the steel on the far side. We can fix that later. And then I'm wondering if under supports is just better here. Wedge that up against there. And then I mean that saved us a grand. And then just slight up so that we actually land it. Uh oh. We're starting to reach the the end of what up we have available without starting to lose some velocity. Oh, maybe maybe we have actually uh It's okay, I wanna let's see, so we need to go above our cursor. Yeah, we're bouncing off the lowest point we can hit, so whatever we have done to this bridge, we may need to add an additional piece to the jump. Some of this steel probably isn't necessary. Yeah, we've we've radically lost speed. So I guess we just do like a little bit of something like that. Now we're now we're all the way in in two land. Over the cursor. Okay, there we go. And it's a it's a smooth travel through, but is this even cheaper than our last? Yeah, we've we've shaved like a thousand, but short of a redesign that uses less pillars, which let's at least tinker with that idea for a second. Cause we could potentially Potentially do 
steel all the way under here for, I think, cheaper. But I mean, our bridge is like really lumpy shaped, so we're not getting any good arching at all. My plan is to kind of expand all this out like that, and then also utilize this and that. Is this, is this an important? I feel like we're actually surprisingly close. Like if we took this one and this one, just so that we can get kind of this a little more. Like that breaking, whoops. That seems like such a, like a lot of these feel weirdly unnecessary. close. Where did it break? Hmm, up here. That's not, that's not a great thing to have break. If we just change the impact a little bit, it, it's just, I think it's just bumping a little too aggressively. Yeah, it's kind of like this, this lump is not helping us. I could do some, some over under over here just to try and help stabilize that. Okay. I think it was this road here that broke. No, it was this road here. What? I guess there's a ton, there's a ton of pulling weight because I guess we can move this, right? We can have one foundation, but we don't have to have it this far over. Maybe we, maybe we try and center it a bit more. That could be, that could be an interesting idea. Centering it does seem to have helped. Okay. This side over here was was constructed with with the expectation that we had two foundations near each other, so maybe we can get away with you can turn the grid off to get this smoothed properly. Ooh, all right. That was a big, was that like a 40 grand shave? Top 11%. We'll go, we'll go a little further, I think. Cause I, I feel like there's definitely, there's parts of this bridge we haven't even looked at. Like that, that might not be needed at all, to be honest. Not needed. Let's this this up here just feels weird. I feel like if I did a better job up here, I could skip that. Okay, yeah. Doesn't break. Ooh, we're so close. What broke over here? That's a, that's a tricky, that's a tricky one to fix, feels like. 
Yeah, so okay, so it's getting... It's getting a little bit of a pull force at the end there. Beautiful, all right. Top 8%. What's, what's the cheapest here? 46k, wow. So do it for 46k, a lot of, I, like I think this would have, I mean, even if I, if I imagine getting rid of this, we're still at 85k, holy cow. I hope someone puts something in the, uh, in the gallery. I'd like to get it below, let's see if we can just get it below 100,000. That feels, that feels attainable. Okay, yep. Some of these ones in the middle here probably don't need to be steel. False. <laughs> we haven't even done anything with wood muscles yet, so that's probably next on our... Uh... Like this, this thing I don't think is doing crazy work. Use the eye to just make that nice and good. And then these two, right? Probably. I mean, if these, if these convert over, we are well on our way to our goal of getting below 100k. Alright, that's a success. This almost, uh, that probably needs to be, but I mean, if we just cheat this up and cheat this up, any chance we can... Well, that's below 100k. But that was that was a pretty big structural change there. Yep. That's that's probably not the place to tweak. Maybe you're okay. All right, looks good. Okay. Under 100k, top 7%. I'm down with it. Let's take a look at the gallery. Under budget, short, the lowest under budget is 62k. Oh, wow. The, the, so much less, oh my gosh, I love the tension on that one. Holy cow. Yeah, so, so basically the, the key with this one is I just made my bridge a million miles too long. Beautiful replay there too, wow. Oh, I love this one. I'm sad it's so expensive, but such a clean catch. And then curry in a hurry, well done. That's perhaps my favorite solution to date. Here's a much more elegant version of what I did. Did this one use two foundations too? Did we get down to one foundation or were we on two? We were still on two foundations. So the best, the best solution still used a foundation, which I think is really exciting. Oh, wow, look at... So maybe going low was hurting me. What is, what is even going on here? Okay, so taking advantage of the horsepower. This one's more expensive than mine though, so. But yeah, it looks like a good arc and then and then a little bit of tension went a long way on this one. But uh but yeah, that was that was still a nice one. Let's uh let's head on to the next one. <laughs>